ABC's general hospital sports revealed that Willow's condition is now worsened, and everyone knows about it. Willow could not hide the pain and was hospitalized. The doctor also diagnosed her with terminal cancer. Willow's missed chemotherapy, so the only way we save her life now is to donate her bone marrow. This would be easy if Willow had a relative, but she has no relatives. Only Carly knew that Nina was Willow's biological mother, and there's a chance that a marrow transplant would be a good fit. But Carly again selfishly didn't want to tell the truth. Although, Carly knew Willow was in the final stages of the illness. She chose not to speak out. Carly will call on people to test for compatibility with Willow and their marrow and donate to Willow. But when will we find the right person to donate bone marrow to Willow? Can Willow wait until then? Or will she really have to die when she can't be saved anymore? What will happen? Meanwhile, the fact that Heather and Anna successfully escaped from prison made everyone extremely worried. The police also soon issued a wanted notice. And the person who's especially dangerous is Heather, when she has so many crimes. But now just Heather didn't panic and went to Cameron to eat bread. Heather knew at that moment Cameron wouldn't call the police, since it was her grandchild anyways. So she wouldn't do it. Cameron was quite frightened when suddenly seeing Heather come looking for him like that. Even though they were grandparents, they weren't close to each other, which caused Cameron to panic. Heather explained to the frightened Cameron that she was very hungry on the way to escape and saw Cameron's shop light up. So she decided to go in. After Heather left, Cameron informed the police, even though Heather knew them in advance. Trina and Joss also rushed to visit Cameron after learning that the criminal had come to find Cameron. They were concerned for her safety and feared that Heather would come again. Police will also send someone to protect Cameron before catching Heather. Will Heather be arrested soon? And what's Heather's next plan? Who will be in danger this time? Besides, the fact that Anna has successfully escaped also caused a lot of trouble, especially for Valentine. Valentine is the one who devised a plan to help Anna escape from prison as soon as she knew she's about to be transferred to a dangerous prison and could die at any time. He didn't want that to happen. So, he helped her despite everything. Valentine also knows that the person behind this is Victor, so he's worried about Anna's safety. But now that Charlotte is still in Victor's hand, does Valentine make the wrong conclusion? Victor already knows that Valentine saved Anna. He's very angry, and Victor didn't expect Valentine to be able to do such an act of betraying him. Surely Victor will not leave Valentine alone. Victor will now call Valentine asking for Anna to turn herself in, or else she'll kill Charlotte. What will Valentine have to do when he has worked so hard to help Anna successfully escape? Will Charlotte really be killed? Can Valentine save the two people he loves, and how will things turn out?